Godzilla, Mothra, and King Ghidorah, giant monsters all out attack, is a really good Godzilla film, part of the Millennium series. This movie came out in 2001. This movie has really good special effects, amazing designs for the monsters, and an original story plot. I really love the fact how Godzilla is evil, like really evil, just pure evil, and he's fighting off the guardian monsters like King Ghidorah, Mothra, and Baragon. NECA has finally released a wonderful figure from their Godzilla line, which is this version, the GMK version. This figure is phenomenal. Let's start off with articulation. This figure has a lot of articulation. Let's start off. First, his head rotates 360 and it's on a ball joint. His mouth is on a hinge, opens and closes really smoothly. His neck is also on a ball joint. So that it moves really smooth. His arms on a ball joint. They're really stiff, but it's like a nice stiff. His arms on our hinges, they open and close really good. His arms, his hands are on ball joints and his fingers clamp in and out like how they do with the 54 Godzilla. Now he has a big old ball joint on the waist and it goes 360. His feet are on ball joints, his legs are on hinges and his le whole entire leg is on a ball joint. His tail is consisted of four segments. And the last one being the smallest one, which is the bendy wire. That's a really big improvement from NECA. Just look how this tail moves, it's such an improvement over the rest. Now let's look at the detail. The foot looks phenomenal. It looks comp really good, like how it did in the movie. The tail looks dumpy in this picture, but that's because the angle I took of it. His spikes look so nice. They're sculpted with such precision that they look rigidy and ragged like they do in the movie. The amount of detail put on this figure is really nice. The person who sculpted it must have a big love for Godzilla, so not the figure wouldn't come out this good. Just look at his face. His face just says everything. Pure evil, the face of death. Look at those blank white eyes just looking at you. Would I get this figure? Of course, it's $20. Its quality is really nice. I think it's better than Nancy's March Store. It's not even own it. It's just that good of a figure that you should get it for $20 at your local Toys R Us. Thanks for watching, please rate and subscribe.